What's happening, Pedro family? Welcome back to another episode of the Whiskey and Weight Show with me, your host, Tommy Mack. And me, your better host, Tara McKenna. And listen, we are joined by a rat. <laughs> <laughs> Scumbag. <laughs> the, whole, the crack himself. The king of Sandy Road. <laughs> undefeated, up and coming prospect. Just won the WBA. What was it? Continental European. Continental, Continental European. Um, he's a champ anyway. Friend Fuck of him. ours. <laughs> former phone <laughs> <eggs> back. <laughs> Just proudly her own last Joe, week. Joe, Joe's a higgins. Lewis Cracker. Back Listen, this show. Lewis Cracker is a fan of the show as well. Him and his mates. His mates watch it. So uh, it's a pleasure to have you on. Yeah. Hey, mates, pleasure being on. As I say, it's a big fan. So, um, so. You may have to talk loud because you actually perforated both of your drums. <laughs> in the yard. Actually, yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> Second <laughs> round. I was like to my missus after. I was like, the atmosphere wasn't great. Like, the atmosphere was unbelievable. Do you know what I told me? It's like, I couldn't hear from round two. <laughs> I wish I knew that to him. <laughs> Fuck me. See, when you hit it, it was, it was, it was this ear first. Mm-hmm. Boom. And I just heard a big ring. And, <laughs> and I, fuck sick. Flat and then I was like, I was supposed to put off balance. You know the way it fucks your balance uh, up? And then you bang this one. Bust that one. I was like, hey, fuck. <laughs> you evened it out now. <laughs> so I couldn't, balance back. I couldn't hear nothing. At all during that fight. It was yeah, fucking I, ridiculous. That was famous class like, from the get-go. Uh, so see me so. walking out. I, I didn't see your walk I heard your walk It was good oh, uh, But my walk I fucking loved it On the I shotgun tour the, I could see you in the corner And all I see you just going I want to get some Some clear during the fight week I was not shit myself <laughs> <on this. laughs> I genuinely I'm so used to big face uh, I wasn't shit uh, And I think you were. I actually wasn't, mate. I actually generally wasn't. I think it was, nah, I mean, I think it was like a... Yeah, I felt, because of the way you're getting... Uh-huh. See, was, and this was nowhere less, see when the head the head happened, mm-hmm. I was thinking to myself, he sounds like he's rehearsed this about 600 times. Oh, mate, you give me 10 weeks to rehearse this. <laughs> <laughs> so you said something in her I could have shed your side. You were... Oh, so I could have shed your side. I couldn't get a word in and you're screaming in my face I was like I'm going to choke his cunt I'm going to choke his cunt if he doesn't fucking back off because I couldn't anything I, I couldn't say anything you were just screaming in my face madness uh, and I was thinking to myself he's rehearsed everything here and then I was trying to say something but I hadn't rehearsed anything so you just started barking and tapping I said fuck this he's getting either choked or pushed right now so pushed me and he's like, you're shitting yourself! <laughs> Look at you! I'm not fucking shitting don't fuck around. Right. Fuck <laughs> How do you feel it in, in the fight week? Class, mate. I was, just I was, swearing, I was, I was confident, mate. I was like, I, mate, I, was just, I was fit and all, do you know what I mean? And, mm. and you uh, were, you're that's what I'm table. saying, mate. It was like, so from like 10 weeks to 9 weeks out, mate, I was getting notifications, you know, you do the interviews and stuff, and I was like, fuck, see, I gotta be sitting in Scotland, mate, and I got a notification, and I was like, I'd be up shuttle box. But I made that everything about the zone and all was Oh, uh, it was like, unbelievable. See, and that junior, you haven't been in, that's your first major, yeah. major fight. I've been in lows and I was bigger, mm-hmm. I felt bigger than, than them all mm-hmm. because the bottom was, see, our far mm-hmm. fight not, uh, be, not be a main fight. It felt like a main fight. It felt sure, like a yeah, fucking yeah. huge week. I've seen week on, on social media people were saying, it's the people's main event. Mm. It really it was. was. It was. It was me. Yeah. Like, because originally champ. the first promo for the show was used to. It was a great fucking promo. It thing. was. And me. we were speaking at, at that stage. We were speaking to each other. And we were like, it'd be a joke of wasn't for the IBO title. And, uh, okay. and we were saying it will sell this place out. It's fucking everyone's talking about it. And we were buzzing for it. And then it, it didn't get the IBO. And I was like, I I come with it, or so you said you weren't drank ten enough in the yard, I like, but yeah. you weren't. I could not break for that. And I was, I was like. I so, number five in the world across five bars. <laughs> do you know what, do you know what, see, do you know what, I was, I was fuming about because originally when I took a fight, I'm fighting you, headline mm-hmm. SSC, I'm fighting for an IBO world title, mm-hmm. and like, you it was a bit, much bigger, a bit yeah. it wasn't bigger, and I was like, that's lethal, and then the zone came, took us uh, off main event, so I was like, it's not a main event, but at least it's for the IBO world title, and then the IBO world title uh, got took off, and I was like, What's the, the point? Why, why, why am I taking this <laughs> this cocker again? Now? I, was, I, like, I, was, I was surprised, mate. Do you know what I mean? Because like I thought you would have went for a bigger name. I like, could have. You could have. Yeah. I would have been a hypocrite. Oh no, mate. Like fair play. I. Yeah. People were asking why have you taken this, and I said, all my whole career, I've said I'm fighting the best, and I, and people were probably saying, oh, he's talking shit. 
uh, I want to fight the best every time. And even the time where I was saying the podcast recently, when I got offered three fighters in the field, Lewis, or Jose Felix was mm-hmm. one, and he was 30 knockers, he was 35. Uh, I didn't need to take him. 100%. There was much easier fights, same as yourself, much easier fights than you. I could have fought that Italian. Uh, like, on, mm-hmm. on the SSE arena, mm-hmm. but I said, no, I want to fight Lewis Crocker. Mm-hmm. Because the fans fucking wanted. Yeah. And it's uh, worked out better. They'll think, do you know what? Really, when you was in trouble? <laughs> when the bell went. <laughs> <laughs> no, not that I knew it was in trouble, I just knew it was going to be a, a tough night because I had jumped on the scale before going to the, the SSC mm-hmm. and usually I'd put on 10 to 14 pounds. Mm-hmm. I put on 3 quid pound. Uh-huh. And I went, yeah, I can't, I can't <laughs> go and be huge. What, what weight were you going to do? I must have been about 74 kilo. Like. Uh, uh, that's, that's what just, I said. I, 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 I jumped on the scale and I was like, uh, 68.6 or something. Oh, you were fucked, man. Uh, <laughs> and here, you can feel it in there. Like, see, anything I wanted to do, I just think like, I can't do it. I couldn't uh, even risk seeing 10 punches because mm-hmm. you're too yeah. big. See, the, uh, you're a big welterweight. When you walked out, you just looked strong. And before it even started, I said to him, you just looked out and you went, right, let's go. I was like, fuck. It's you can just feel things. the weight. Mm-hmm. You know when you spar someone heavier and uh, you know, they get some big thing mm-hmm. to weight and you were just too big for me. And I went, I went back out the first round and said, Pete, he is like, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Game plan is not going to happen today. Uh, I mean, I was like, I was surprised, like 30 seconds in and we were starting to get out of it. You know mm. what I mean? And I was like, because I was expecting you. War? No, I was expecting you to box. You know oh. what I'm saying? And then when, like, once the gap like closed like mm. early on, I was like, fuck, I was playing in the, what I want. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, but uh, were you disheartened at me laughing at your punches at all? Nah, because I expected a bit, <laughs> you know what I mean? Some... Seeing you were still doing it right here, hate... I was like, what's wrong with this guy? Did you hate <laughs> that <laughs> I thought I was a you, man. Did you? I thought you would have got cut and I would have dropped you. And yeah. neither yeah. happened. Because yeah. like, you weren't be banging him in. But you know what, Lewis? Uh, you needed a wee bit more finesse, eh? Because... Mm. Like, see this, what Tyrone said, the same time punch which you were trying to mm. tame him with, like, you would have done damage oh, if you landed. Done damage. But Do you know what? You, you, were, you did hurt me. I think it was the second round, and you knew you hurt me, uh, and you jumped on me. Uh, yeah. But I only get it. On, like, most boxers, when I get hurt, I get hurt for a split second, mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. and then I'd be recovered straight away. So you jumped on me, and it was sweet when you jumped on me, but, and then you hurt me in body shot as well. Where I was like, fuck, I was a good body <laughs> shot. But I don't think you capitalised on that either. Yeah. But uh, you were never getting me either. I just fuck. I'm, oh, I'm the yeah. hardest cut in the oh, world. No, I mean, that's the thing as well. It's like, I, like I always knew your like your fitness was always good. And mm-hmm. then if it was like, if I hurt you early or anything, yeah. I was like, I'd be even a scar to oh, I go for it. Yeah. Wrong, I, you know what I mean? was my hope as well. Uh, I was kind of hoping you did hurt me early. Mm-hmm. And then you blast out and were bollocks. Uh, but you were fit. Yeah, you're very, fit. very much your performance. Do you know what? I couldn't you're even go. Very well, I couldn't even go the full pace that I wanted to go mm-hmm. because you hit too hard. For fear. Uh, like yeah. my spars, I was going flat to the mat mm-hmm. for 10 rounds. It was a, it was a hot pace. It on, wasn't like. for me. Mm. Uh, but I couldn't because I was like, it's, con- <laughs> it's content. <laughs> and then it was disheartening when I was whacking you going, oh, come on. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, that's really fast. I don't think people realise how much we were actually like laughing. Uh, and talking, do you know what I mean? It was non-stop. Uh, you talked about the shit the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> it was fucking <laughs> brilliant. And even, well, I, even I, 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 I looked at <laughs> <laughs> I looked at the Billy Billy uh, fucking nose oh, and stuck him in the tongue. And, uh, uh, you uh, you whacked me when I held on, didn't you? Know, I, uh, uh, I, no, mate, you turned around and I was still whacking you and you still had your tongue out still. That's right. Uh-huh. And I said, back ahead, right? And you went, you were all turned around. <laughs> but I tell you, you hit me three low blows. And what's the... You want your point they wanted to say. Right? Oh. I knocked your hip out of place. That's what I wanted to say. It was weird. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the, the hold twice. Mm. I've never felt a shooting being like it here in the face. <laughs> Damn what bum the fuck, sir? I'm saying crap. My, my, my <laughs> hips are still sore. <laughs> fuck. I remember you saying it about that, actually. Uh, like, uh, fuck. It was bad. Uh, but uh, I don't even know if you, know if you matter, because like, I'm fucking six feet one. So mm-hmm. who yeah. were you sparring for the face? No one of them, no. Well, yeah. Just hurt Jack to get Carroll said people. you asked him. Uh, I mean, yeah. well, I said that's a very weird one to ask. Because oh, he's a short guy. Uh, I said, well, just, just, just fought, or got loads of South Paws, mate, mm. from Scotland, mm. and they're about, mate. I, mean, I actually wasn't able to spar for the last two weeks, well, mate. Yeah. Then get out, nah, mate, or fucking. I had a wee problem with my hand, so did I did die. Same Did you hear about that? No, I, <laughs> I heard, no, I had a problem with my hand. Uh, and I was actually told, look, you need to 
pull out and get a surgery because uh, my the tendons here or my ligaments here pulled off my knuckle mm-hmm. and it was fucking killing me to start my account uh, anytime I punched it was fucking killing me and I said Tommy I can't pull out this I need this uh, fucking coin yeah. <laughs> and I'm not pulling out this week I'm not pulling out this week anyway but magically it healed yeah. itself no it was I all good I wasn't so that was when the game plan developed I was like you know what I'm going to box ahead of this mm-hmm. guy because in sparring I was just jabbing like fuck and mm-hmm. then only using my left hand when I knew it was going to land mm-hmm. and I was sparring lethal that way and I was like you know what this is going to work <laughs> and, then, and, uh, and then at the end my, my hand started being better the last three weeks four weeks it was fully better and it was fully better for the fight so there was mm-hmm. no excuse about that and uh, I couldn't do the game plan <laughs> <laughs> could be sparring like for just heavy heavy handed mm-hmm. cunts mm-hmm. um, just people that had it like fuck but I, honestly, it's, they don't make chins like me. Nah, I mean, because you hit me. Movement. Some clean shots. Oh, and I, yeah. I said, my the podcast, I was questioning the sanity. Sometimes I was going, hi, man, I'll put that on <laughs> that And there's some of you who hit me, can I, can I get off and trouble G shots? Yeah. Darn heavy here. That's what surprised here. me the most, man. And I was like, what the fuck? I was hitting people like in Sparm with 16 hours, man, then like dropping them, like with like them shots. And when I hit, I mean, I was. Thumping them like in the <laughs> These were eight or ten. Eight. eight. We're the last week to do eight. Oh. See, I moved up to this week. I went happy days and more tens. Then. I got like, Tito's first fight as well. No, I did. I seen that. I seen that. I was I seen the cross race. Usually wear the dollars. 100%. And I did the cross race. I seen Tito's now. And they're there pulled back. You can see they're pulled back now. I think. I can't come in and they kill me oh. here. <laughs> no, I mean, as soon as the fight got announced, I was like, fucking. I had to put my get all the Kratos. Kratos the fuck. Kratos the fuck. I actually never had a laugh at that. It's going to be a hard out of <laughs> But I mean, even you could take a shot as well. Like, you're fucking. You've got, you've got everything. Mm, like, yeah, you're fast. Sure, you're fast, you're elusive. You, you're fucking fit, surprisingly. Uh. And, uh, <laughs> but you've got you good fun style to watch. And you can take shots like I was fucking winging the mist, <laughs> and they weren't affecting me. Well, obviously <laughs> you're way above me, mm-hmm. but I still hit hard enough for. I know I don't have loads of knockers, but I do hit hard enough from weight, mm-hmm. and uh, you're just shrugging them off and playing. Did you get any um anything from Matchroom after any like? Nothing yet. I think I'll probably go through Jamie. Do you yeah. know what I'm saying? So are you part of Colin Boxing too? Oh, I mean, like, I, like, I'm with Colin Boxing, yeah. so. I probably wouldn't go through for them as anyway, and then Eddie, Eddie was saying because so. before the fight, I had mm-hmm. done an interview with Eddie, and I was like, mm-hmm. Tyrone has left the message for him. Why is he not saying and all mm-hmm. this stuff? And then he says, Well, if he boxes well in it, we'll mm-hmm. send him. And he said, You box but, very well, so so hopefully, me at all. The Roman is like, I tried, I tried my best to steal your thunder, and I retired <laughs> the day after. <laughs> <laughs> Happy retirement, hey, by the way, sir. Happy you. retirement. It was a I pleasure. Sa- I said I was going to retire if my next defeat. And like my heart, I had there's hours fucking mm. getting too much punches. The fucking <laughs> I started to notice myself slurring and stuff, and I just need to kick out before I, before I'm fucking before kind of speak to my kids. Well, um, yeah, like I said, it was a great platform. The Fed obviously stole the show, great platform for you to showcase because you're an up and coming fighter. Now you you move from prospect to contender mm. now after mm. it, after the weekend. Um, why well, are you open to talking to anyone or do you want my room? Yeah, whoever gives the most money, like, isn't it? Yeah. No, I mean, like... But, but even, like, Tom was talking earlier about opportunity, the bigger mm-hmm. picture. No, the money isn't the... Somebody yeah, could yeah. offer you a million and I you'd know. be sitting on the sidelines for a year. My room, don't get me wrong, like, what they did there, opened my eyes, you know, like, how, like, professional they are and yeah. Eddie Hearn as well, like, he's the man, like, so hopefully my team come in with stuff and, and you know, we'll work stuff in it yeah. because I think uh, it's a good start the next year yeah. if I had something set and a plan mm-hmm. in the ring so I don't see why not as well has, has there ever been any talk with top rank because Conlon and top mm-hmm. rank were close to yeah there was like last year and then I was meant to fight like last August and then I got injured and stuff and then everything just fizzed out you know it was, mm-hmm. it was the long layoff and everything so top rank was there originally but then just not yeah, top left. No. And like if you just it's, 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 see once he becomes world champion, basically just because of me. Like if you, <laughs> I give him the after <laughs> opportunity. And listen, that's, did, that's why he's, he is where he is. <laughs> what, what was it like after a fight then? When you when you, did you go out celebrating or? Did... I made, but like it's funny, mate. Like usually, I go out and I look, I look like time to you know, enjoy myself. Mm-hmm. Let's see now. It's like. I mean, I can't wait to get back in the gym and all. It's You're buzzing for your career now. Oh, I mean, do you know what I mean? But like, the career's took off now. That's just, do you know what I mean? I think I've like matured a lot as well. Yeah. I mean, fucking, uh, definitely, like, 
I feel good. Like I know where my career is going. And like mm. I'm set up in Scotland's brilliant mate. So it is with Billy. Like Billy fucking does everything for me, mate. So Billy set a brick with her own quarter. Of my- <laughs> 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 the, he said, "It's oh, always my son." Did you know it was going to be said? Don't do that. Did I? Yeah, you know what? You know what? I forgot to say the press conference. I'm raising that. I took the videos and all of it. Did she? Ah, uh, see, fate week uh-huh. or the week before the fate. Someone from your street bought tickets off me. Did he? Hi. Fuck, is her name, really? I'm not giving names. But, uh, I mean, but it was William. <laughs> what, you're, you're Prince William or something? Prince, Prince Andrew. Uh, uh, it's face yours, like it begins with E, E, U. U, P, U, P, I don't know what the uh, fuck it is. But I was like, where the fuck's this address? <laughs> I was like, BT, was it 14, is it? Or 12. 12. Oh, BT, right. That's why, BT 12, so I was like, it's supposed to be down Falls Road. <laughs> that's why I'm driving, and then the next thing, it's saying, turn left and sound your road. I like, what the fuck's going on here? We're not in Kansas anymore. I was like, I had my wee Palestine shit, and I said, what the fuck's going on in there here? And as you'll fly, you were British flags over, and I was like, what the fuck am I doing down here? And it's Sam tickets, and uh, I found it out, and I was like, I know where you live. Uh, I was like, this Crocker lives over there. <laughs> and I delivered tickets to this house. And I videoed it. I was like, some fucking support you had. I was, about to put it, I was about to say in the press conference, uh, and they put it up on the Thursday uh, or Friday and annoy the fuck out of you. I don't be thinking about that, but. <laughs> your mum be getting pulled out of the house. <laughs> I'm not going to say who it was. Uh, but he lives facing him for that fucking number 13. You be getting in there here. Well, see, I have a lot of Protestant fans anyway. And you've got more now. I know. No, I you've got a lot of haters still mm. slobbering to me. <laughs> like, can they leave me alone, please? <laughs> like, getting people at you, you cunt cracker battered you. <laughs> like, I was like, maybe you're proud of us. <laughs> and then he's sitting here depressed. <laughs> and he's like, sorry, man, I'm only joking. Hey, you're fucking lethal. I go, and then you're fucking 40 years between you. But they're fucking still torturing me. Uh, Whoever Maggie May is, who is that? Um, I know who it is. Who it Tell her to fucking stop. Uh, she's on the road. Uh, she's giving torture, is she? She's very sure. Well, uh, even during the teacher in the whole cup, I just get tortured by uh, Cracker. You didn't give me some sticks through it. To be uh, fair, listen, like. not, not as much as I could have. I know 100%. Sell, you were selling it. I was so sorry. Listen, that fate like, was huge. It was, it was because, man. Because you didn't do what it killed me to do. I, I do. Mean, I see when you were writing stuff, I said that I wrote my mirror. I was fuming. I was like, because like, I want to say something, and he was like, just leave it, mate. You know what I mean? Sure. See, take be the bigger man. When, when I seen you oh, in the I SC, see I said, he, mm. I ain't going to be giving grief for the next 10 uh, weeks. Do whatever the fuck you want. Because I'm not, I'm not used to that, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So it was just like... You were just getting the fury. I, I mean, I like... So I think you said I didn't give a fuck about it. Uh, uh, like, yeah, it's all part of the game. I like, understand that, yeah. uh, but obviously, I mean, I didn't want to get drawn into it because, like, yeah, I'm not you, like that as well. Yeah, yeah. And it fucks up. See, my yeah, see, see, if you do get drawn into it, see, when I first used to, I used to get drawn into it mm-hmm. with like Sean Crenel, it puts even more pressure on you. Exactly, yeah. mate. That's so why you just... being quiet was the smart thing to do. Mm-hmm. And me being loud is because I, I'm used to it anyway. Uh, yeah. So I'm used to all that fucking shit and I don't give a fuck about mm-hmm. it. And I, so you've done the smart thing. But I was like, I was wanting you to fucking beg. I know, mate. And like, I wanted to so bad. And the more I thought about it, I was like, I just, it just makes sense if I don't say it. Yeah. You know what I mean? It was good because you weren't quiet. But I was going to do the promo. I, I seen in the paper you said he's back on these. I mean, did I spoil it for you? No, no. Uh, I didn't do it because it was too big of a fail anyway. Uh, and I didn't need it. Built. Like, normally yeah. when I do them, I pay him out of my money. It costs mm. six or seven hundred quid to do them. And I was like, what's the point in paying to spend that money? We had That's a good one we were going to do Craig Lale Dundee. That was the uh, first day. I was <laughs> it's like, going to be me. Craig Lale Hunting. <laughs> he's teaching teach me how to crocodile hunt and then going to be wrestling with, with, with fucking crocodiles and shit. I've been fucking about it, but, uh, but we ended up not doing it, unfortunately. I should have done the, it. The stuff. promos are always class. They, they are. Oh, I mean, they are good. So good. I wish right? I had it because it wasn't my last fight, mm. but uh, fuck it. How do you feel about retirement? I've got it, but I think I've got it more just by getting beat on Saturday. Mm-hmm. So, Fuck's sake, Liz. You know, you <laughs> it's depressing. <laughs> I, I don't go soon, mm-hmm. and I think I'll be happy in retirement. I fucking think it's deserved. I fucking mean in war after war after war. Mm-hmm. And like when my stage you said in the fucking face to face. Oh, yeah, you actually were hitting some foul pots. <laughs> when we slower each other, Liz, so I'm concerned. <laughs> Man, how much more can you take? Like, I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I saw like, <laughs> <laughs> like I have like my eyes are fucked, my back's fucked, every every camp, my hands are sore, 
I can't turn my neck fully. <laughs> you don't need medical <laughs> 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 Like I'm <laughs> proper <laughs> fucked. Like I'm fucked. So mm-hmm. if I took more, I would. I, 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 then go on. I would have dropped weight. I would have went back to the original weight. I wouldn't stay at welter. Was like welter too much for you to get the weight? Well, down? see at the ten for when it first turned mm-hmm. welter for Chris Jenkins. It was after my wedding. Uh, honeymoon stag and all that. Good three months old, I put mm. on loads of weight. I was like, I'm never going to make welter again. Mm-hmm. Or late welter. So it got down. As you said, it looked shit because I wasn't training mm. properly. I didn't watch your fight, man. <laughs> like, <laughs> I, mean, I just heard what I was saying. Do you know what's funny? See, the views I've seen, I've seen Lewis Crowley, you know, I don't think I've ever watched your name. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't uh, know what you boxed. <laughs> I watched you a few times, but I don't the count. most impressive <laughs> I've seen you was in the gym spawn. Mm. I've always thought you look lethal in the gym, but in the fights, it's hard to look I sound because you're baiting people who uh, you're supposed yeah, to be. So I literally, I've never watched you box. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I watch me, like we won me clip or something, uh, or a clip here and a clip, clip there, but I've never watched the food fight of yours. And uh, I said, oh, I've watched them, and I've watched them, like fuck. <laughs> I've watched them. I don't like watching people. No, no, I mean, because yeah, see, I the do. thing is, you get in the ring, it's going to be completely yeah. different. Yeah. Like, oh, like, he could be trained in a completely different way for mm. Like, just worry about yourself. Definitely. That's what I do. So uh, I don't even watch you, but. Uh, <laughs> What about your man Lewis and he comments on that when I was around talking to the kids and we landed in Holy Trinity. Yeah, I'm going to launch a box for both of them. I Did you? Oh, you know what six or eight titles for Kurt I Lewis? couldn't believe. Not one person says. <laughs> <laughs> so I was, was, was heartbroken. I was going right. This, this is going to be good. Like, you know, you think you think we were setting up, but then we were up. I know like, it. They're all going to pick Lewis. I was these current logs, and then every single one of them was like, "Charlie, is like, hey, it okay? No problem." And then the real one from Holy Trinity is like, "Red, right, he'll definitely say Lewis." It's going to be tight, like what I hate. McCann. He even says, you know, he boxed Holy Trinity. He doubled down. I know. I know. Fucking hell. Do you must have annoyed you, like, all the uh, polls that were up? It was always uh, me winning. I mean, after, like, see, especially after we did the the common market thing, uh, I mean, everything just went for you. I, I was like, I'm a dickhead now. <laughs> it's like, do you know what I mean? It's like, I had a bit of support now, everyone's coming. <laughs> 11 year old fucking screaming like a schoolgirl. I was like, I came the, uh, became the villain here. I knew. <laughs> I see what after you screaming like a lot. I knew I was going to slate the ballet to you at the press conference. I knew it was going to win the press conference. I'm like, oh, fucking look. <laughs> Sound <laughs> better in the bathroom. Because <laughs> <laughs> I knew I'm a great talker in press conferences. I knew I couldn't get what I was going to say because you're shouting at me so much. Mm. I was like, in the press conference, I'm going to slap him. <laughs> it's going to definitely be my, my, be my round. Mm. And I was just had everything for you in the press conference. Yeah, right. I'm glad there was no fans or like. <laughs> <laughs> and then, uh, even on the. Because all the things I was saying was facts. Mm. It was all fact. I was like, ah. Uh, they all knocked it down. And I got up and fucking laughed. And <laughs> it's funny. See the public worker. So me and Sean had down to get like behind the scenes content. But we didn't get you. You must have just split straight after I was upstairs. And I took an ass few minutes after I was right. I said the term. Oh, we got loads of stuff down at the public worker. Did he get Lewis? I was like, nah, obviously not. <laughs> but we just didn't get you because we couldn't find <laughs> <laughs> uh, fuck me I love the build up you know it's fucking yeah, it was it was at all. So even good. like the wee fuck the face off thing and stuff with mm. them with Darren Barker and all yeah. do you know what I mean it was like it was built up really well how how did you feel in your first big fight week Berlin, mate. I loved did it you want uh, it you want uh, more I, mean, I always her. thought like did you, was it what you expected or it was better than you expected it was better than what I expected me at all I just, just everything about it mate, was better than expected but I think because it I visited it for so long, you know, like mm. how, I knew how big it was. See, from the get go when we did that in the Odyssey, uh, you knew was I was be. like, I know this is going to be big, yeah. like, and uh, See, I didn't. Uh, I knew it was going to be big, but obviously because it was in bigger fights, uh, I was thinking it wasn't. I knew it was going to be big, but I didn't, I didn't know it was going to be that big. This one, yeah. uh, I thought it was huge, dick. That's the first time what, was forty years or something like uh, Belfast, Belfast, like. It was no. great. It was great. I fucking uh, yeah. <laughs> rest, rest in peace, shoot. Yeah, but uh, he was the last person to. Do one of them Belfast beat Belfast face 40 years ago and uh, I always called him when he was alive We Red mm-hmm. I thought that was his name We Red and it turned out it was, I got, I got <laughs> rest in peace shoe We Red and then it turned out he's called Little Red <laughs> <laughs> did you have it in your thing uh, We Red oh. uh, 
I, I just seen everyone read, oh, I was a ch- touch and thing for Little mm-hmm. Red, and I was like, fuck, is his okay. name Little Red? <laughs> oh, <my laughs> he never cracked me once, sad to say this, and I was like, sorry, I called him, he really never said that. Your own, your own name. Hello. But, but see what he's done as well, lads? It was great for Belfast City, because, you know, as we all know, it's a divided city and all, things are getting better as, as time goes on. But the two of you fighting from different sides mm-hmm. of the wall, the Matt Fargo wall, well, actually, the literal wall. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it brought fight fans together. And because mm. he's put on such a great show, both sides, like, you've got new fans, you've got mm. fans, sweet but late nights, you were tired. But, <laughs> you know, I got love from yeah, both sides. Know. And it was just, everything went off peacefully because there, so, there was worry that there's going to be a clash. Mm. You no know, guys from Sandy Road, guys from the Falls. But... It all went off great, and everyone just had a mutual respect mm-hmm. for the two of us. You know, the the old lamb bound out, going out in the shield, the young lamb, you know, raising mm-hmm. the stock. It was great to see. Hundred percent, man. I just like you say, from both sides, like you know, there always was a, a bit of worry because mm. you get something. There as was good, uh, a lot. You know of, I mean? We were thinking that uh, like I even said, even if we don't say on about it, it's going to drag. Uh, it, but it didn't. I know. I'm glad it did. And I, well, I, there was even interviews on Fate Week. They were trying to break. Uh, I mean, I don't know. And I was like, I don't want to. Be attached to that. It's yeah. fucking a massive thing without that. Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah, it's fucking. Hey, there were some of your fans who were trying to drag it in that. In but the, it's in the meals. Now. In the meals. <laughs> I don't know that you would oh, even know. But it, that's, that's what they do. It's, they love it. Um, and you said you were getting fucking. Uh, I mean, I was getting them as well. So it was, especially after. It was, see, the push thing. Uh, after that, I made a fucking getting slated. So were like, you? Uh, <laughs> on the for this one. I was like laughing at it. I had to remember a quiz. Get that off the fucking. But see, like, it, like, you've never been like that. And there have I. We're not, we're not that kind of people. And uh, I didn't want the, the fate to end up like that. Like, no, like a sectarian thing? Yeah. yeah. Like, even though the promo for it was like, fuck. The flag is coming there. Like, all, like, well, well, the all British us. flag and it had the every, know, every coast. Know, it wasn't even that. It's like, <laughs> the Panthers, every coast, <laughs> black, and, black and gray, so you couldn't tell. <laughs> well, like, especially in boxing, there is none of that sectarianism mm-hmm. at all. No. There's nothing race, colour, nothing. We're all, we're all Arab. Oh, there is a boxing family, especially Belfast. So we've all known each other. For, mm-hmm. Like, obviously, we're a wee bit older new list, but... Then We've always had a good relationship and friends. So We've right. been bad drinking the car mm. and the fucking behave oh. on the Falls Road <laughs> and Davenish. You know what I mean? Um. You haven't invited me up your way there. You're in the 12th next year. Uh, <laughs> oh, I'm stop me on it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I bring it up in Sally Row every week. I've been name dropping you for years. Anytime somebody comes in, like, they're getting up. No, let's cry. That's me. We did But for the last 10 weeks, I haven't been able to say anything. But the next guy was friggin' Steve Moore. No big Steve Moore. <laughs> it's Granny lives right now. <laughs> was there any worry, or did you were you very confident going into the fight? Was there any doubts ever going up to it? I mean, I, I don't even think like I was letting myself have like any doubts. Yeah, I, I understood. Just creeping in. You do you know what like, I mean? Like, down, winning, winning. yeah, because like the other thing was like, fucking, uh, do you know, like, what, wasn't it, wasn't it to lose or whatever? And mm. then, like, that's in there, and then I was like, I'm fine. Right, you know, I was like, yeah. I'm fit. I'm, I'm, like, yeah. I was, I was my only thing. See, especially because I had like three fights this year as well. I mean, yeah. I started to feel like myself again. I felt I felt the right time for you, the wrong time for me. For like a year, year and a half out of the game. Fuck's sake! I'll See, take Lewis first. What, what was your uh, racing like? Did you just stay in Scotland the whole time? Yeah, did you? Um, stay for what? Like many many, t- many sessions a day. We do what? What is it? twice a day, Monday to Friday, uh, once on a Saturday, and then and like towards rest, like yeah. uh, Sunday rest day, unless like. I was to fight. Do we run to get the weight down more? Mm. Just stuff like that. I was the weight. I know you'd take off your boxers. I mean, no, do you know what happened? So I went and bang on without my boxers at like half ten in the morning. And I was like, I'll lose point one by him. Yeah. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. And when I got there, I was must have still been the same weight. My weight was like, I was fine. Nah. Well, I, 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 I did it in my last fight too. <laughs> first thing. I got there, I was point two over. 91.2. I was like, right, I'll be all right. Went back, it was 91.2 again. And I went, the weights had seen 90.6. I've been making 91 <laughs> my whole life. Had to go and train like fuck and then had to get, get on the scales naked. Made right. 90.6 on the button. Yeah, I like the, but it's, I went around because my eyes were in bathroom skills. I wanted good skills. Uh, so I said, fuck, I want to try. 
at like 10 o'clock in the morning I went around had a, had a check way I was 0.5 under really? and I was like right my skill because my uh, skill set is bang on she's like fuck happy there you can have a coffee uh, so I had a coffee geez, I, wouldn't even I mean step. a small coffee it would have mm-hmm. been 0. 0.3 maximum boxers know what uh, everything yeah, is yeah. so I was like that's 0. 0.3 maximum and it was still a few hours to go so I lost 0. 0.1 anyway mm-hmm. and I uh, jumped on the scales with my socks on uh, or whatever you uh, I was 0. 0.2 uh, right? what the fuck is, <laughs> I ain't not 0. 0.2 they'd, mo- they'd move the scales a bit and I must have just fucked up the fucking the weight I, I already like, say he's over he's over and I was like oh fuck and then I started the yeah. worry and all that. I was like fuck I'm over and then it says about the boxers and all because uh, I, I was about to get my boxers off uh, and everybody like, get the towel again get the towel again I was like fuck's sake I ain't going to slag loose now uh, and then I got to go off the socks and my socks faded and I was like thank fuck and uh I was going I, I hear it walking out to the wee Sandy Row ones sitting front <laughs> front centre for the way and boom he was like he's cunt it was cunt was only around the corner oh, so no, it was nearly it was all Sandy Row I know I was the like throwing back on to me when I ran and he went yeah, there's not much support here at all. <laughs> I know. I was like, I don't have any supporters anymore. And, and they're just all inflatable freaking uh, crackle down to everyone. And uh, I was like, fuck me. He had some support over it, but I knew when it came to the stadium, I'd probably have bigger support. Uh, I, made, I felt that as well, mate. And then uh, I, even, like, I felt some booze at the start, like for me, and then like I was smelling and stuff, but you said I feel like everyone's it, see when you got your when you're getting your name called mm-hmm. I heard a few boos as, as uh, I was doing that uh, but I mean, I mean see everyone who's there they're going to be your fans now like mm-hmm. after that performance go, and yeah. do be their fans everyone who watches this yeah, follow this man he's a legend and actually we were friends before mm-hmm. and we're friends now so he's a legend of a man he's not actually a dickhead and he doesn't usually <laughs> scream in people's faces <laughs> 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 but, uh, but uh, like you're going to have a massive fan base after that performance as well just think people just love me have, have you noticed like my... your profile growth <laughs> have, uh, like your social that? media and oh. stuff have you noticed it like oh, increase sure. a lot yeah. of yeah. like probably getting like 4,000 new followers and stuff like across social media um, and then yeah, just oh, I mean just everything do you know what I mean like the, the platform as well like the, the zone just I think everything's just come at the right time now yeah. for me you know what I mean and that's a good age too 26 no, no I didn't realize you're that young because mm. I've known you for from your box uh, the wrong way with the big boys for uh, yeah, I've, I've always known him so I always went I, know, I knew he was young but I always thought you were like 20 or 29 uh-huh. so I thought you were 29 uh-huh. until the week of the fight I actually walked in them and barbers to get cut with Billy even else and stuff in the, the <laughs> oh, shirt. Oh, said to me, actually. He paid for my haircut. Thank you, Billy. <laughs> he did tell me that, Dean. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like, I like Billy. I've always, I've known exactly. Billy for years. And uh, I get along with Billy. Mm-hmm. And uh, so I was always, I, I think I said that, I, was, I seen Rose that week and I was just having a uh, chin with him. I was actually waiting for you to come into the, the elevator because we were staying. Oh no, we had so We were staying in the same hotel. And after that push, I was like, I'm gonna see it come the elevator. We're at the Guara. <laughs> Do you know what, I mate? Mean, I seen a thing. I was like, Crocs. You wear Crocs in your feet and slap them in the street. Uh, so my whole thing was like, he's gonna try and slap me. No, like, we doing a face off here, man. So that was my whole thing as well. I mean, I was like. I was like thinking maybe if we got the thing like you'd have tried to slap me and then go away or something I was like you're I right for me to <laughs> <laughs> I just said that because it rained <laughs> but uh <laughs> even even there's there. your bathroom must be also dragging <laughs> 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 but uh even see after the push I pushed mm. you the next day, I guess Con's going to try and give you back and push me. So you see me when we're going to head to head. I put my foot forward, so I'm, I'm going to stand. So you can't push me back. So I was hoping you were going to push me. Now it's going to go nowhere. You're going to look like a fucking people cunt. But I never happened. Uh, but do you know how it was going to be pushing a bit of? I, th- I thought so, mate. Oh, I thought so, but then I fucking had to take the boxers and all off. I was oh, like, fuck this. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> see, see what that happened? And I had to take my socks off. I, I, my, uh, everything just went off. Oh, I, I did, I didn't it? Oh, like, mate, you know what was funny? I didn't realise, like, when we were, after we thing, and, like, we were both mm. did that, and then, like, you went in front of me, and when I, I must have hit your hand uh, or something, I, I, I didn't really. You. You're fucking... <laughs> <laughs> I, only, I didn't see it when I was talking. You fuck. see me doing what the <laughs> fuck you do? <laughs> <laughs> I look like a hard cut. <laughs> I see that. Like, he is a tough cut. Uh, yeah, sick of him. All everyone was. Like, we we go- fucking bouncer grab me. Oh, yeah. I see that. <laughs> but that was all fucking beautiful. For the sell it to make it, it bigger. No matter what, it was huge. I loved it. I, 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 Cause I couldn't hear properly. I was like, "Are they when? cheering for me? like during the fight?" Or I was like, "Are they cheering for me or cheering for him?" Was it big? I know one stage what it did for like a combo and a good. 
came out and landed on mm-hmm. you. I heard a big roar. Oh, and I was like, I haven't heard him. Let's see when you <laughs> fell. I was loving that you, you know, fell. I was fuming. <laughs> <laughs> because me and I, like, I, I just slipped on. I, I wouldn't have. I wasn't slipped. <laughs> And, I and then the slip. crowd went oh. yeah, I was like he's in for it now Stop <laughs> thinking of that I started laughing you had G And then the bell went Oh that, that, that did my head so uh, I knew that on your head People were all saying Did he clip you Did he rock you And I was like I slipped uh, I was saying you just slipped It was nowhere near a rock down But uh, at least the referee Knew it wasn't a rock down oh, I, Hello I don't know if, uh, I need to, Have you you've, you've watched the back I have Have you watched the back, back? I watched it back. Uh, You've watched about ten times back. At least. Look at this. Everybody, 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 just let's be a radio. No, man, the, the comedy. Did they, they give you give it? Because they're like, yeah, this cracker is whacking them and Toron's just standing them. This but guy's not like, human. <laughs> they were like, friggin', even, I think it may have been Darren Parker's. One of them said, Cracker's Corner must be giving him a rally. Like a Drago thing? Yeah, Drago switch. He's, he's, like you're no he's not like. a man he's a piece of iron <laughs> <laughs> that's what I didn't look like <laughs> they tried to Pete did try well I'd say try maybe it was a bit of like you need to start giving it more he was like look we're made out to pull this here mm. blah blah and you're not fucking pulling oh, I mean, I, I knew like you would never have uh, like, I think I'm sweet he uh. pars away because obviously it's fucking sad or something yeah. I was used mm. to your power him. I think he's pars away I'm fucking sweet and then the other corner mom was like are you sure Tron are you sure and I was like I'm fucking sweet just aren't putting uh, this you want him alright I kind of knew he was getting beat and I was like I want to finish the fight Lewis uh, goes back right right in the corner in his fight or in, in, in his corner and he goes I'm well up oh, in the I corner mean, you haven't lost it right <laughs> <laughs> but you don't you can't tell I, you, you can't tell that's what that's why I was, I was like I was going in that time frame and I asked him up because there was it must have been like so zoned in or whatever, yeah. and especially with the crowd, mate. And I think you only really feel the punches land on you more than the ones you land on them. Mm. Like you're all, you're all, I'm always like, shit, right, he's whacked me, but I don't know what's landing on you mm-hmm. compared to what what I I get hit with. I knew it was there, like <laughs> <laughs> I knew it wasn't good. And even my corner, my corner was like, you need to give something mad in this last two rounds. Uh, and then last round, he's just like, look, go out, enjoy your last round because yeah. like, everyone knew you. I was we, just tearing after that fight. Uh, I was hoping for a wee robbery. <laughs> like that, turn around, turn around. There was no trouble for him, but what happened? Right, Dad's like, be great for a year, Robbie. Right? <laughs> <laughs> the street rings are popping. <laughs> oh, fuck. I love that. Oh, oh man. Yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck. They couldn't have robbed you. They couldn't. They'd have been fucking brilliant. He wouldn't have been here right now. Definitely not. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> oh, fuck me. <laughs> But uh, I, do you know why I thought you were, when you were nervous, it's because, see, for the face-to-face thing, mm-hmm. you are being a lot nicer Yeah. Mm-hmm. More than the previous fucking encounters we had. Mm-hmm. You started being nice in the face-to-face sit-down interview. You were being nicer to me, and I was like, I just can't want to try and warm to me a bit Be more. Nice, so not, yeah. There's not as much pressure. Mm-hmm. Was that a thing, though? Or did you just realise you are being a dick when I said, stop, <laughs> stop being a dick? Don't do, don't do it again! <laughs> I, think, I, mean, I think I was like... Because like I said nothing during that fight thing, mm. do you know what I mean? Like I wanted to show you that like, I was confident. Yeah. Do you know what yeah. I mean? Like like a, some presence about me. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like so, but I know what you're saying. When we did that face off, I, I felt that there was more. Yeah. You know, like, but it's probably because there's no each other and all uh, too, so it was probably weird to fucking sit in the table and go uh, red. Say something about him. No, no. Addy <laughs> heard before. Was like he's better sales. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> that was, that was, wasn't planned on the whole matter and I was like will I be biggest plan we got the co event as well fucking yeah. straight well, off the had, back end I was off the back of our, our week uh, so that didn't need to happen yes so to be honest it's, as Mick said and fair play to him for saying it on uh, the press conference fair play to him that it should have been main event he was mm. stealing it on us and I think it should have been it was a fucking and it felt like it big enough for it to be anyway. yeah. it was it was sure, big enough it, was, it, it felt like it anyway what, in my eyes it was a, a main event for myself mm-hmm. but and for the crowd, because everyone, every, I see when we were not coming, we were going to be the one before coming. I was going, mm-hmm. I said to myself, "Is it the first time this place will be absolutely rammed uh, for that time?" At that time yeah. at all. 
And I was it. like one of them were meant to be on like second or something. No, in the car. I was like, it was disgraceful. Yeah. That was like, I, I'll take home an event all day long, but when you put me on set, putting us on second, uh, the way yeah, it was built up and everything, hell, I, yeah. I thought it was like, it was. I was like, I was a bit of a joke. Uh, and then definitely. when I got her to go, do you know when I got on? When, well, after the pushing, and then I looked up at the wee table and I seen my your names and said, oh, I, I, <laughs> I turned around to one of the matching ones and said, Am I coming in there? And he's like, Yeah, you're coming in there. I was like, Great. Thank fuck. Because <laughs> it did deserve it. It, did, yeah. it really did. It was fucking, because it is one of my last, it was my last mm-hmm. fight. I, like, I really mm-hmm. needed to be a big fight, a Definitely big night. And, and, and it was, obviously. But, uh, what, what was that like compared to like other times you fought in the SSC? It was, it was, I wasn't as nerve wracking. Mm-hmm. I don't think. Like I was feeding off. I thought you were shitting yourself, to be mm-hmm. honest. And uh, so I was feeding off, thinking this cunt shit himself more than I'm shit. Obviously, mm-hmm. I was nervous as fuck. But uh, but in the change room stuff and all, I was pretty confident, to be mm-hmm. honest. <laughs> <laughs> pretty confident. <laughs> I, <think it> was. <laughs> um, I thought. Uh, I just you the whole fight week was just unbelievable for me. I thought it was the one of the funnest fight weeks I've had. Mm-hmm. That and the progray fight week. Were my funnest week, but the stadium and how packed it was, and and uh, even walking about town, I went in, and I don't know what you didn't fight day, but I went on a walk. Mm-hmm. Everyone oh, stopped me. Uh, everyone got pictures. Everyone saying they can't wait for the fight. They're all fucking going to bars, and I was mm-hmm. like, "This is fucking huge." Uh, I mean, even like now, you know, like a lot of people like, really are recognizing more and stuff mm-hmm. now. It's, oh, it's gonna be a big fate. come down for you mm-hmm. if you don't have a big fight next. Yeah, to come off a of bad know. Even fight day, Google. Was trending our fault on Was it really like, like you, you just clicked on Google and didn't type in anything. It said mm-hmm. trending topics. The <laughs> that's class. And like, that's like, huge. Wow. And like, anytime I want on, like, in there, a BBC, a BBC article is popping oh, up right. about us. Mm-hmm. Or even even now, after it's all about fucking me. I turned on to How penguin is this? Me and Trina's in the car the next day, driving to get, or me and Ken, sorry, mm-hmm. driving to get my suitcase from the hotel. And he sticks on the Uredo. And Lewis Crocker has defeated Terry McKenna. Turn out, turn out, I'll stick. Can you please? <laughs> I think, like, fuck's sake. But uh, like our fight was, it was a huge fight, and it was, it was a great fight to go out on. I know. I wish I'd have probably threw more and, and and give a better account of myself, but it was still a great fight. I don't, know, well, I don't remember. I think you showed don't. as well, mate. Like the toughness everyone knew you had. Yeah. I was glad I ended up fight not getting knocked out because they are a hard hitting man, and I could have I could if I'd have got knocked back knocked out, I kind of would have ruined my career. Mm. Like I went, Tyrone wasn't that tough, mm-hmm. and like at least yeah. I've got the hardest cunt in Ireland yeah. title for the rest of my oh, life. Oh, without mm. a doubt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I spoke there was a too. time <laughs> you went. I don't know what hand it must have been, but whatever mm-hmm. strong hand. Whipped one up and whipped one up the uppercut. Uh, yeah. I just laughed there. So I was, fuck me. <laughs> and I, I just laughed at you and said, come on. I said, fuck, you can hit hard. Oh, I remember. <laughs> and I went, he had like, fuck. <laughs> I, I spoke to two people in the fight week who'd sparred me. Mm-hmm. And I said, like, on a scale of one to ten, like, or where would you put Lewis in the hard punters, like, with all the people you've been in the ring with? Both of them went, ah, oh, he's the hardest. <laughs> and I was like, Tony couldn't hit that hard. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking, there's no way you can hit harder than Progre. I think the difference between you and Progre, I'd say you could even maybe, it's about the same level mm-hmm. part. But, but a bit of finesse. Just, just obviously you're on a big, you're only starting a big face now. Mm-hmm. He, sometimes you can see your big punches coming. Uh, His were just weren't, were tal- as telegraphs. Uh, yeah. yeah, but, but you do hit all your upper with world, yeah. world class power. Cheers, man. He meant to drop me, but I felt every fucking him, shot. <laughs> honestly, there's honestly it's big, big, big power. Yeah. So don't judge it on my chin. <laughs> <laughs> I just a hard cunt. But <laughs> <don't laughs> <don't, laughs> everyone loved how he said when I said that. Oh, I, don't I wasn't even bad uh, to be. Like and you big... got a timing as, as as well. You know what I mean? <laughs> Fuck it, I didn't know what to say. See, going into the press conference, I have we won Leonard already uh, made. So I had when we were on Leonard, when Leonard sitting there, and then that one wasn't, wasn't one. one. It wasn't yeah. one. It was just like don't do it again. And everyone was like, "Fuck me!" It sounds like he's talking like this. Song. Oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, that's about us. Yeah. We've wrapped it up. We've wrapped it up here, Lewis. Thanks for coming on. Yeah, After the fight, and, and if that. you see me in town. Don't be gloating and buy me a paint. <laughs> I mean, we'll have to get a paint made. We'll have to get up your way now. Hundred percent, mate. And uh, 
people of Belfast get behind young yeah. Cragger. This is guy is earmarked for the future. And uh, don't be trying to drag him down the wrong path or anything. We're pushing him to the top. Yep. This is the next guy who's going to take Represent. over the boxing scene. And uh, everyone. I mean, everyone I've been beat by. Well, well we're hard fighting world, for world, t- world title, let's say, expect. The rest of all been world champions, more or less. So. Yeah. So now, let's let's, let's keep it that company. way. Yeah. Yeah. Keep Absolutely. it that fucking way. I don't want to be... You got people in Lewis Cracker, he didn't win nothing. I don't want to hear that. I don't want to fucking hear that. So, right now, I've only been beat by world champions and a future world champion, yeah. hopefully. Great. So, once again, Lewis, thanks for coming. Thanks for and having me on, lads. All his fans that are watching this, subscribe to the Patreon. Yes, Absolutely. subscribe to the Patreon. Because I'm skint now. <laughs> <laughs> Peace. Legends. Legends.